platform that serves the needs of business developers who are trying to make the best use of their assets and skills when extending their on-premises solutions into the cloud. And finally, Dave Thompson just showed you how, that we ourselves are betting on our own platform with our own apps and how we're giving customers the power of choice. I know you've seen a lot and you probably have lots of questions and yes, the sessions on Azure are really going to help you a lot. But maybe the best thing to do is to just sit down and write some code. All of you here at PDC have paid for the privilege of doing so, and I thank you very much for doing that. And so you're the first ones who are going to have access to our Azure Services Platform CTP. Starting at noon today, you can download the SDKs, register for, for provisioning, for Windows Azure, .NET services, SQL services, and live services at azure.com. Each of you who registers will be provisioned and activated over the course of the next two weeks. And then we'll be opening it up much more broadly based on what we learn together in the weeks and months ahead. The services and the service model that you'll be playing with are still pretty early, and yes, we're going to be intentionally conservative in the progressive nature of how we're going to be rolling this all out. 